was better off for it, as they're about to go crazy. Uh, his journey began right here, right in, uh, in Trinidad, and uh, ends up right here in Las Vegas at the Olympia for the 10th time, and uh, Darren Charles uh, having a lot of fun out there. Making his rookie Olympia debut, Fuad Abiyad. Watching the Olympia debut of uh, Canada's own Fuad Abiyaz, leading the way of the crop of some great Canadian bodybuilding champions. And uh, it was an emotional moment in Dallas, Texas, just about a month and a half ago when he qualified for this contest. He decided to hop in, and, uh, and I was thrilled to be standing on the same page, the same stage as uh, many of the greats, including idols like Jay Cutler and Betsy uh, Jackson. Fuad Abiyaz is very excited to be here. Yeah, and he should be because this is a stage that the majority of bodybuilders who turn pro never get to stand on. Quad's a young guy. He's got some really good tools to work with. He's in good shape, hits good condition, pretty balanced. And, uh, you know, he's going to be here again. I, I really believe that. And you can see here his conditioning through his hams. His lower body's very good. Just needs to get bigger, keep improving. But he's made significant improvements since he turned pro a short time ago. And time's on his side. He's a young guy. I know, Dan, that he debated about whether to do this show, and he said at the press conference that the conversation with you led him to it. What'd you tell him? Well, basically, he talked about wanting to compete in the Super Bowl of bodybuilding, and I explained to him that the Olympia is not this just the Super Bowl, it is also the All-Star Game, and it's an honor to be a part of it, and uh, he took that advice and decided to uh, make his way here, and uh, I know he's happy to be an All-Star, because uh, he belongs here, he looks great. About to hit you with his party break. You know. You know, Dan, you have to keep one other thing in mind. When, when you're an Olympia competitor, that says something in the sport right off the bat. And regardless of where you place at this show, especially in your first shot, you're being seen by tens of thousands of people on the webcast. You're being seen by tens of uh, thousands and thousands of fans. And it's an opportunity, not just to compete and see where you stand with the best in the world, but to build a fan base on a business side of the sport. I think it was a great move for Fuad to take your advice. And if there's any question about what you can learn at the Olympia, he finished, Gustavo Bedell finished 21st at his first Olympia. The next year he comes back, finishes top three. So an education for Fuad Abiyad, we'll see how it goes for him.